Good evening everybody, it's Fros. How are you doing? We're back in Star Sector and tonight we're going to do some cool stuff with our new Medusa. Um, well, we need to get it outfitted before we can do cool stuff with it. And I've been racking my brain and I was thinking that Jangala, I believe, did have pulse lasers at the start in my first episode when I checked the market there. So our goal is to make some money, get to Jangala, buy a pulse laser. I don't. Th I think that's all we need. Um, let me just check. Uh, and we need something to go in these universal hardpoints. I have no idea what to put in them. I'm still unsure. But hopefully Jangala has something that gives me a good idea. Um, so let's get started. Now we need to be careful because these Tritech patrols are chasing this independent and we don't want them to detect that we're here. Um, actually let's quickly check if there is anything to buy on Kethlin because we are short of money. That is very, very cheap heavy machinery and we all know that I love to ship heavy machinery all over the galaxy. Uh, so let's just fill up on heavy machinery, why don't? Wow, it's cheap. Get all of that and um, get back to the open market and just fill all the, to wear out money. We've got plenty of supplies, we've got plenty of fuel, we've got plenty of crew, so I think we're okay to ship it. Okay, let's see where near here. Uh, messed up there, I wanted to click on Intel. So, Corvus, which is a Nagala system, is buying them for an okay price. Hyversil's got them for 430. The Ema system is asking for 410 for them, and it's not that far away because we're in Valhalla at the moment. Um, so we could go, what's on what planet? Corus. Okay. It is a pirate station, I think. Uh, Corus. Yeah, it is a pirate. It's a military pirate. Oh, we went here before because we were looking for pirate ships. I think we could make it though. Oh, is there anywhere better? I don't really wanted to go to a pirate system. Well, the only real other choice is Hydrosil. If we go to... Oh, we're not in... Are we in Hydrosil or are we in Valhalla? We're in this system. <laughs> and it's worth a ton of money. So let's just do this one run one last time up to Et Yokabres and then we will head and find somewhere to buy the last few things we need for this ship. So we need to get away from this patrol. And when we're a decent distance we can stop big going dark. Uh, are they chasing us? Nope, they're patrolling, but we can't afford to put up our... Yeah, the independence is just getting smashed. This new version of the game is much more dynamic than what I remember it being. Just, there's so much going on that I I only remember happening with mods before, maybe I just played too much mods. Too much mods? Too many mods. Uh, so this is us. I think we might actually be able to go in dark here as well. Perfect. Uh, so let's sell off all this. Yep, tons of money, that's a great deal. That's us back in the money again. Hooray. Right, let's see if there's anything we can outfit this guy with. Uh, phase Lance. Yeah, but we don't want a Phase Lance. I, I was looking at Graviton Beams um, as an alternate for the Pulse Lasers, but I think the Pulse Lasers are, are a good choice. What can we put in these front slots? If there were dual light auto cannons, I might go for them. There are light, oh, light dual machine guns, not what I'm interested in. The other thing I was thinking of was some sort of missile, but there's no options here. Let's head to Jangala. Is there anything we can buy to take to Jangala with us? Are the drugs cheap? The drugs aren't too bad at 270. Um, can we sell drugs in Jangala for 270? We have no idea how much drugs are going for. But if we look at Magic and Samara, they're going for 470, so we'll be able to make money out of them anywhere. I think 270 is a decent price. So let's buy as many drugs as we can on the black market. Well, let's only buy, let's buy a thousand worth of drugs. So we've still got three grand to spend on guns, just in case we run into problems. The other thing I want to start looking for is uh, merchants, not merchants, what am I talking about? Mercenary captains that start taking over our ships so that we're not relying on just basic AI for them. Because if we do cool stuff like put, um, what are they called? Like aggressive guys in ships, it just changes the way they work, and especially since they can learn skills like we can, it, it makes them much more efficient at fighting. So I think that's something we need to look at doing. Now we don't have to worry about being scanned and shouted at for carrying drugs in this system, but when we get to Corvus we will need to be careful. But I think we'll make a decent money because it's completely illegal in those systems. Uh, so let's be very careful. Are they chasing us? No, I'm going to turn off my transponder and we need to just head we need to head south fairly far. Just, there's just hyperspace is just insane in this version of the game. There's just fights everywhere. I don't want to get into any fights until we've outfitted this Medusa, and then we can just come storming in. It's going to give us such a huge advantage over the 
Uh, frigate fleets. Right, I'm going to turn my transponder on so nobody shouts at me because we're coming up on Corvus now. So over here to the right. And Mercenary Company. If there's, what we want to do really is we want to jump in on Barrett because that's probably where we're going to get the most drugs. Barrett is where the pirate bases are. Um, so I probably should have actually turned off my... So there's two pirate bases here and a pirate station. And one of these we should be able to sell the drugs for a decent price. In fact, because we've come into... In I think we've got a decent... Well, let's have a look how much they're going for here. 58 credits. <laughs> Are they selling them for 58 credits here? They're selling those ones for 58. For 73. Uh, we really screwed. Oh, wait. Someone's buying it for... No. Hmm. I might just buy those because they're super cheap. We'll find somewhere good to offload these. Oh, do you have pulse lasers for sale? You do. Yeah, just grab a pulse laser. What about missile weapons? There's light jewel auto cannons. I was thinking about putting those on. Or harpoons are also pretty good. Single shot harpoons aren't the best, but they're cheap. Or salamanders, actually. Let's do salamanders for now. I can't afford a second salamander. How much money do I have left? 207 credits. Okay, let's, let's scrap that. We'll just go with this. We'll set up some weapon groups. I want to do my capacitors and vents now. This ship, because it's a large ship, can take a lot more. We're producing 800 flux per second, so let's see what we can do with, with what max vents gives us. 600. That's not too bad. We can go max max. We've still got space left over. Um, that'll do for now. We're now going to make this our flagship. So we need to go into here, drag this over put ourselves into it um, let's just see if we can find somewhere to sell these drugs I'm just gonna try Barrett B because you never know there's a pirate fleet here they're they're, sell they're buying them for 247 but we bought them for 273 so it's not quite good enough uh, let's move on let's try Jangala or one of the actual legitimate planets in the system so let's turn on our transponder and where are we we're up here Jangala's over there. Let's just set course for Jangala and hope that we don't get randomly picked on for a scan. I'm sure we're going to sell them for a decent price at Jangala. And then we'll look into some bounties and we'll go bounty hunting. There you go. This guy called Anus McKenzie. Um, Anus McKenzie. Aeneas, I think, is his name. Not Anus. Uh, is looking to be... Right, so we need to be careful of these attachments. But we can check prices without going in dark. That's fine. So they're buying drugs for... 260, which is not a good profit. Let's just try our last option in the system, which is a Sharu. And if not, we'll head to that system where they were selling for 400. And we can fight pirates on the way. Actually, I don't think pirates will trade with us. Oh, they, we, no, we just traded with pirates. They will trade with us. They are selling here for 176. I thought that was a really good price, but maybe it wasn't. Um, okay, what's this? Oh, it's the Stellar Shade, right. They've got like a, a thing to stop Jangala getting too much sun. Let us head out of the system because there's nothing here for us. We came here to sell drugs and we bought drugs, but we did get the gun we were looking for. We do have the pulse laser. Uh, we need to watch our supplies as well, and our fuel actually. We're running low on both, but we should have enough to jump to another system. So let's just see where we can jump to, because we're not going to make any money here. Um, Intel, right, recreational drugs. Samara's buying for, f wow, they've got up to 700 in EMA. What's, what type of system is Samara? What's, so, do we take the risky run and deal with pirates by going to a pirate military base to sell them for 700? Or do we take the easier route and go to Samara? I'm going to take Ema. Because when have I ever, ever done the, the, the sensible thing in this game? Right, well, how do I get to Ema from here? We should go up. Hopefully we've got enough fuel. I'm sure we've got enough fuel. We'll be fine. I'm going to turn off my transponder. Let's not fly through hyperspace storms. So this is the edge of the EMA system. Now what is... Yeah, I know we're low on fuel. It's okay. We're at our destination. Okay, now what was the name of the planet that we needed to go to? Oh, it's, the price has dropped. It's still the best price. Um, chorus. So are any of these a Chorus jump point? So there's a Chipu Opchi jump point. That's the... The Visasha jump point. See, this is a dual... This is a binary system. I'm gonna jump in. I'm gonna jump in here, actually. Oh, we got sucked into the sun. I didn't even know we could do that. Oh, because we ran out of fuel. 
We've actually completely run out of fuel. Right, chorus is up here. We just need to be careful. Oh, we're out of supplies as well. Crap. There's nowhere else to go. Okay, let's... If we mothball the Phobos... And Frost's Folly? Then we have too many crew. Okay, we'll stick with this. Have I just been... Is this super striking again? Have I been far too confident? As long as we don't get in a fight, we'll be fine. He says, jumping into a pirate military system. I don't like taking the easy way, do I? I always try and do the really hard thing. This is not what I want right before Christmas, is, is to lose my fleet again. I'm not going to lose my fleet. I'm good. I'm sorry. We haven't suffered any damage yet, but our, com <laughs> our combat readiness is dropping rapidly. I don't want to get into a fight. Right, how far from... Okay, we just go up. Straight up from here. Okay, this is Chorus. There's no sign of any pirates. Please be a decent price. 706 credits. Okay. <laughs> I like taking risks. Let's buy 100 supplies. 100 supplies, thank you. And we'll buy all this fuel. Okay, so we've got 20,000 credits left. Um, so we haven't really made that much money after refitting our fleet. Any ships for sale? Hamdi, nothing interesting. I can't check the pirate military. What about the black market? Just D ships that I'm not interested in. What about weapons? Anything good to outfit this guy with? They've got salamanders, which is what I was thinking of getting. Salamanders, I don't think I've, I've talked about salamanders much. I don't think I've ever explained what a salamander does. It's a special missile that homes in on an enemy's engines and disables their engines with a power with EMP. It says there in the description. They're quite good if someone's trying to run away from you. Um, there's also swarmers, which just like fart out hundreds of missiles. Um, oh no, they're not what I thought they were. Oh no, it's something else. Sure, he's got a missile launcher. The missile's designed to destroy enemy fighters and do little damage to enemy ships. I don't really need that because of all of the lasers I have. Um, hammer class torpedoes, harpoon MRMs. This dumbfire rocket is a field adaptation. Oh, it's dumbfire rockets. A single, devastatingly powerful, unguided torpedo with an onboard engine. Medium range, high payload, guided missile. I'm kind of tempted by harpoons, to be honest. Because I can probably get their shields down quite easy, but I don't want the single shot harpoons. I can't buy salamanders because I'm not openly announcing myself, which is hilarious. I'm going to go with salamanders. So let's... Um, any captains, actually? No captains. And we can't take a pirate. Right. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> yeah, they don't like me enough to let me shop when my um, transponder's on. So let's... <laughs> I forgot about that. Sorry about the noise. What we're going to do is we're going to very quickly buy harpoons just for now just so we're not under equipped uh, i leaves me with one extra point i can't do anything with but that's the extra point i got from the skill i got last time so it's not too much of a problem um, i want to refit my ships i can't repair them here we're probably going to run out of resources quite soon right let's find out where our bounties are so aeneas mckenzie is in wanted in aeneas exodus ashley batax so wanted in Corvus, which is very close. Oh, even better, Barasulax is oh, finished. Never mind. So let's head for Ashley Patax in the Corvus system. And we'll, we'll fight some pirates for the rest of this mission. Uh, we want to go here. Let's jump out point nearby. So things are going to change from this point onwards. We're going to go on the offensive. We're not going to be running around trading anymore. We've got a fully outfitted destroyer. And two really nice frigates to go with it. So what we're going to do is we're going to build up our fleet size, maybe get three or four more frigates, and then we'll look at picking up a carrier after... We'll probably look at picking up a carrier maybe after two more frigates. Um, and we'll basically play it... <laughs> people run away from us now as well, we're a bit scarier. We'll basically play it by ear from there. But in general, that's what our, my plan is. Two more frigates, and then we want to pick up a, a carrier and some fighters, and then we'll, we'll just sort of go from there. Uh, what system is this? This isn't Corvus, is it? No, it's Aslan. Sorry, I don't mean to spasmodically continually hit spacebar to pause the game. Okay, so where is this guy? 
Um, actually, Bat Axe. Near Moors, which is that planet that's miles out of the way. Probably want to jump quite close into the middle of the system in that case. Because I don't know which direction it'll be in. Uh, Moors is all the way down here. How are we doing on supplies? We've got tons of supplies. We've got enough supplies to do this mission. We're using one supply every two days. It's probably going to take us about two weeks to get out there. As long as we don't fly right through the sun. And there's a new bounty being posted as well. There's constantly bounty bounties being posted, and that's where we're going to start making money. Because 20,000 credits a pop for one fight is pretty good when you've got a decent ship and a decent fleet. Now, um, my producer is a little bit untested, but I think the build's okay. We've got tons of anti-missile. We've got good pulse lasers. We've got three, almost 360 degree. We've got 360 degree uh, fire. I forgot to mention the Medusa's a phase ship as well, so it teleports like the Wolf I used to have does. And I've got two solid armored ships to back me up. It's got good shields. Um, it hopefully right. We need to go dark for the moment. Oh, she's coming for us. Oh, we can take that fleet. That's that's an easy fleet to take. Let's turn our transponder on so we get. So. Um, is this her? No, this is her here. She's... I don't think this is, any of these are her. Let's see. Light assault gun, light machine gun, harpoon MRM, light auto cannon, faulty power grid integrated engines. Why can't I click on this one? There we go. One assault chain gun, one light dual machine gun, degraded engines as well, and then some fighters, which my lasers should make very short work of. Oh, no. I forgot... <laughs> Oh, I forgot to I forgot to unmothball <laughs> my ship. Oh well, we're going in with two ships. I think two my two ships can handle this easily. They're not running. No. Okay. Straightforward fight. So, let's hope that I don't make a complete idiot of myself. See, this guy can teleport just like the uh, wolf can. So we've got fighters coming in uh, over here. We've got this guy coming in over here. Just checking the range on these. We want to watch out for these fighters that they don't get behind us. Because that would be bad. I just realized this guy doesn't even have shields, so let's just fire some missiles at him. We want to watch out for these torpedoes, or that will happen. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. I just lost everything again. Um...